This is the Body Glove Nova Case for the Google Nexus 4. I recently picked this up on Amazon for about 3 bucks, and today we're going to go over the features and see how good of a case it is for the Nexus 4. Uh, so stay tuned for Mobile Technology Review's full video review of the Body Glove Nova Case for the Google Nexus 4. Alright, so here we go. This is the Nova case for the Google Nexus 4, uh, which is manufactured by Body Glove. Uh, Body Glove is a pretty popular and reputable brand in terms of phone cases. Uh, they make a lot of iPhone cases, and they're pretty well known for their uh, for making good cases. And as I said earlier, I picked this case up on Amazon for three bucks, which is an extremely good deal for this case, considering it's Body Glove, it's a well-known brand. Uh, and I just thought it was a steal, so I snatched it up as quick as I could, and here you go, here it is. Uh, first things first, we're going to start off with a quick unboxing of this case. So let's go, go ahead and take a look at the packaging. Uh, right down here it says it's a hard cover that protects and personalizes your phone. That's good. Um, curiously, this is actually T-Mobile branded. Um, I don't know if this case was made uh, during a partnership between Body Glove and T-Mobile, uh, but whatever the case is, it is T-Mobile branded. This particular one it says LG protective cover, Body Glove, you know, blah blah. And right here in the center is the case, obviously. It's got this cardboard cutout on the inside, Body Glove Nova case for the Nexus 4. It calls out its dual layer protection. It has a hard shell exterior and a durable gel interior. Uh, it has shock absorbing protection. It's textured for a good grip and it's pretty thin. And on the back, nothing much to speak of. So there you go. Very simple packaging. And it's also very easy to open this packaging. And there you go. You're done. Nice and simple there. Go ahead and yank this cardboard cutout out of here. So you can get a nice clear look at the case. Um, this case comes in three different color options. You have the white with black or gray accents. Uh, you have white with pink accents and you also have all black. Um, now the all black one, I've seen a couple people that have had it and so I know that Body Glove makes it, uh, but the only two I was able to find on Amazon uh, was this color scheme and the white and the pink. So yeah, overall it's a pretty attractive case I think. Let's just go over some of the features real quick. Um, so on that little cardboard cutout, uh, you may have noticed it said dual layer. And by dual layer they meant that uh, this gray, all this gray stuff is actually uh, like a TPU rubbery feeling stuff. It's actually pretty stiff, uh, but when they said uh, durable gel uh, inside, that's what they're talking about. That's the first layer, and the second layer is actually this uh, white hard plastic on the outside. Uh, so when they said dual layer protection, that's what they meant. Uh, okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at some of the cutouts. Uh, right here we have your camera cutout, nicely beveled and the camera fits in there perfectly, the cutout's perfect. Actually all of the cutouts on this case are uh, are pretty perfect, they fit the phone very well. This is for your speaker grill, again beveled. For your microphone and your 3.5mm headphone jack. And this is for your micro USB charging port and your other microphone. So the cutouts on this are very nice. And right here we have your volume rocker buttons and your power button. Again, these are constructed out of that soft, uh, rubbery TPU material. And taking a look in the back, we have some nice texture right here, uh, which does actually make it a little bit easier to, to grab onto. Uh, it says body glove right there. And the corners right here are slightly rubberized, which makes it nice if you drop it on the corner, it's going to protect it a little bit better which is another nice feature. 
Um, on the inside, like I said, this is actually a pretty stiff TPU material. I wish it was a little bit softer, uh, but it's not bad. This actually looks like it would be more texturized than it is, uh, but it's actually pretty smooth to the touch, so it won't scratch up the back of your phone. Now, in here, it's actually quite hard, and so it, I found that that actually does scratch your phone up a little bit, which is one thing that I really don't like about this case. So let's go ahead and put my Nexus 4 inside this case. As you can see, it snaps in there very easily. And as far as what I was talking about, about the scratching, it scratches this chrome rim around the phone. Uh, this outer edge of this case scratches that, which is unfortunate, but... Anyway, there you go. As you can see, the phone fits right in there very easily, very nicely. All the cutouts fit nicely. And the phone will not fall out of this case. It fits in there nicely. It goes in there easily and it's easy to put in and take out, uh, but it won't fall out by accident. Uh, now, as term, in terms of durability, this is a pretty durable case. Now, obviously, this isn't as durable as something like an OtterBox or something comparable to an OtterBox, uh, but it's still pretty durable. I have dropped it a couple of times and just gotten some slight scratching on the case, and that's about it. Uh, there was no damage to the phone. Now, there is a little bit of a lip right here, which will protect against front drop, uh, but it's not that big of a lip. So it's not going to provide that much protection. And I haven't actually dropped it face down, uh, so I don't actually know how this case protects in terms of face down drops. But like I said, this lip isn't that big, so I wouldn't think that it would protect, it would protect that, that good. Now, in terms of tactile response of the buttons, it's very nice. Volume marker and the power button. Very nice, very good tactile response there. And, I mean, that's pretty much all I can say. It's a good feeling case in the hand. Uh, it's very substantial. Feels good. Uh, and it's quite protective, yet it's not too thick. It's not something that's super bulky like this thick. Um, it's actually nice and thin. It, it slides into your pocket easily, which is very nice. And overall, I'm very happy with this case. Uh, it's been a very nice case for me for the short amount of time that I've had it. And I would certainly recommend this if you can find it uh, for as cheap as I did. And even if you can't find it for that cheap, I would still recommend picking it up because this is a very good case. Uh, so there we go. That's my review of the Body Glove Nova case for the Google Nexus 4. I uh, hope you enjoyed. And uh, be sure to check out my website, mobiletechnologyreviews.weebly.com. Um, I got some cool stuff over there, so head on over there and check, check that out. And just a quick note before I end this video. Um, I have had my Nexus 4 here for almost two years, so I am in the market for a new phone. Uh, my price range is 250 bucks for an unlocked GSM phone. And the ones I've been looking at so far are the OnePlus One, the 16 gigabyte model the Alcatel One Touch Idol 3, the Asus Zenfone 2, and the Motorola Moto G 2014. Those are the four options that I've been looking at so far that are under my $250 budget and are all unlocked. And I just wanted to see if you guys had any suggestions for my next phone. So just uh, leave those in the comments if you have a good suggestion. And thank you guys very much for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.